and then I'm breaking this guy down, and then I'm letting go of it. Okay? We're graduating back to it. When we get this hook down, now we're going to use it. It's going to be a real familiar position. All right? So there's a lot of ways to break this guy down. I just like the hook. Okay? I just like the hook. So double five right jam, swing the boot in, stand up drill. I'm coming across the body, and I'm snaking to my hook. Now, as I drive down to the mat, again, I'm pulling the elbow to his ribs, and in a match, I'm not nice about it. Okay, I snatch his elbow back to his ribs. Notice, I'm just doing a curl right here. My elbow's in his back. Now, I'll get a couple different reactions here. All right, he might just lay there and let me get my chicken wing. If he does, I don't just throw a half in. I literally walk my shoulder up to his armpit. I want that half this deep, okay? Then I'm putting that, then that half in nice and easy. So I'm right here nice and tight. Have we been here before? Yes. Yep, we all know what to do here, okay? One of the other re reactions I'll get from this guy as I start to pull this back and thread my bar or my chicken wing, he'll know what I'm trying to do. So he'll hide his hand down in his crotch and kind of hip down a little bit right here. Because I'm trying to pull and lean, he'll hide this hand. All I'm going to do is reach in the crotch and grab his wrist. Now, I call this a Chirella because Mark Chirella is a three-time national champ from Michigan. He crushed everybody with this. A lot of people call this a Chirella. Some people call it a pump handle or a ball and chain tilt. But when I have my leg in, okay, and I have this back hook, I point my elbow 45, and I'm trying to find right under his scapula right here, his shoulder blade. I'm just going to just extra encouragement for him to go over, right here. And then when I tilt, see I'm driving forward, I don't just fall straight back, I pinch his far leg with my knees and I pull everything nice and tight. Now this is gonna be a real loose tilt, but I'll get him. He's gonna flop around and freak out. I'm just gonna pinch with my knees, and then when I'm ready for him to belly down, he pulls me back on top. He bellies down, he pulls me back on top, boot comes right back in, ankles go back crossed. So he got off his back, but doggone it, he's right back in the fire again. Maybe I just swing, go side headlock, right back to the next side, okay? So again, we're starting to find our rhythm. Like I said, Mitch Clark tech the guy with one move. One move. What a bunch of moves. Huh?